Dr. Seller here, and it's so vitally important to work triple option pass protection versus head up defenders because the biggest thing in pass protection is you never want your offensive line to set on a head up defender. This is why. So you're going to put a defensive lineman at all five offensive linemen, and you're going to stand behind the line. You're going to tell them where to slant, whether it's uh, to your left or to your right. The line is going to slide to the left. They all have to get two flat steps in the ground before they throw their hands. This is so key so they don't set on a head-up defender because when they're in the slide, they have a gap, not a man. So if they slide, so if the line slants away from the slide, this lineman never touches that lineman. He takes two steps, and then if there's nobody there, he keeps sliding until there is. He takes two steps, and then he keeps sliding until this guy comes to him. See, that's the key in pass protection. The biggest thing I've learned in the four decades that I've done this using Paul Johnson's Pass Pro is to make sure that defensive linemen never set up on a, or offensive linemen never set up on a head up defender. Oh, I said that awkwardly. Offensive linemen have to slide, get two steps in the ground, and then throw their hands. They block whoever's in their gap. So you want to condition their eyes to make sure that wherever the man goes, it does not matter. What matters is on the second step, they throw their hands and block the threat in their gap. And if there isn't anybody, they keep sliding in that direction until there is. So work triple option, play action, pass protection versus head up defenders. And tell them to have the fender slide one way or another, but have them all go one direction or the other so they don't run into each other. So that's that.